Hey, what is up everyone? This is Kiran here. Welcome back again to Tech Kiran YouTube channel. We're gonna talk about something different here. Realme UI. I tried this Realme UI in Redmi Note 5 Pro. Unfortunately, I'll not be able to provide you the link to download because I don't think so. Any of the user is using Redmi Note 5 Pro right now. But yes, we're just gonna talk about the Red this Realme UI features. If you compare it with the Mi UI, is it better than Mi UI? In my opinion, let's just talk about things. First of all, I'm using the Realme UI version V1.0, which is based on Android version 10. Realme UI 2.0 is already arrived with Android 11, but we are talking about the Android version 10 Realme UI. But I saw it got some interesting and very useful features which I don't think so Xiaomi users will have there on their devices. First of all, it does not have the app drawer. Unfortunately, in my case, I'm using this simple classic layout which you can say in UI based custom rooms. But in the terms of UI at Sikta, you can see the icons from Color OS, the dialer pad at Sikta. But I saw the performance is actually quite good it's very very interestingly optimized in comparison to me UI, i think so real me ui 1.0 is quite fast i'm using it in just 4 gb ram device even me ui is not fast in 6 gb ram device even not in 8 gb that is very very laggy os everyone knows that so just don't mind that but yes this real me ui is actually quite fast even i'm using this port room even you use a gsi or whatever you want to use on your devices real me ui is actually quite fast compared to the me ui based custom rooms here you also also have some options to customize which you can see in MIUI also but it is basically seems to be MIUI 9 or MIUI 10 because in MIUI 12 etc they have removed all these things like MIUI where you get the security app like that we have the phone manager app in this real MIUI where you have almost all the features the cleaner etc which you can get in MIUI also everything is same like that it has all the Chinese text everywhere but yes depends upon which device or which real MIUI version where you are using for example if you are using real real MIUI on a device or if you are using real me device then you might have some different options if you are using in global or Indian region you might not face any kind of Chinese characters but let me show you one more thing for example if you want to use their cleaner you get some interesting ones like 360 Tencent Cheetah which is already banned in India. Yes, MIUI, they have just removed all these things. You can use their cleaner, but honestly, I just don't use cleaner at all in MIUI. We have many interesting third-party apps already available. SD Made is one of my favorite ones out there. Maybe if you're also using SD Made, you will never use the cleaner app available in inbuilt in MIUI. You also get theme store in Realme, almost same like Xiaomi MIUI because MIUI also has theme store. And like the previous one where I've used the MIUI 10 or MIUI 9, I got the Chinese theme store and Chinese theme store with a lot of bloodware and every paid theme. But right now MIUI is improved, even the China theme store has very interesting themes and no theme is paid. Yes, I saw that no theme was paid. But in Realme UI version 1.0 and the Chinese version, you have all these themes paid but i saw all these themes are paid and chinese themes does not look good at all yes what i saw chinese themes are actually quite bad in this realme ui but yes i will not use realme ui as my daily driver at any case and that's why this is one of the reasons why i didn't bought realme ui yet but yes i will look for it because they have improved a lot color os 12 is equal to oxygen os 12 so yes oneplus is just no more we just hope for the good things in color os most probably now i also try to use the magic scare if you want to root your device with magic realme ui also supports that i'm not sure about realme devices that if you have device and if you want to unlock bootloader and etc but i got the steps and if you want realme videos you can comment below i'll try to purchase a realme device and we'll start making video or videos on realme devices but that's just all now moving on to another things yes the icons are also better than me yes the icons are actually better than me it's just my opinion we had some cool shortcuts here screenshot etc and screenshot has very good animation and you had the directly share option by swiping up that's actually quite good some extra features some of these gestures look quite impressive one and you have the option to share it via realme share or bluetooth messages everything is there and yes ui seems to be quite good in my opinion i think so this looks good 
but everything is just users preferences everyone is everyone has their own opinion screen recording is actually good it is not actually better than the MIUI but yes it's almost good and same like MIUI you have the record system sound record microphone sounds etc video resolution which you can adjust if you want to high you can use up to 1080p 16 mbps it's just up to you but everything else is same this shortcut which you can remove from your device but if you want to enable it it's already enabled by default i just love these features uh, that's why i'm sharing with you i'm not gonna share with you a custom or my sector but yes if you want to use the gsi you can the feature is already present there if you want to use the this gsi you can try out by searching on source for or you can searching you can search on google you will find that and if i get that i'll definitely try to give you the link on my website you can visit my website www.techcurrent.co.in and you'll find everything for example if you want the game center it includes the game center where i think so you get only these games which you can install on a device which i will never recommend you as i previously mentioned you some things are actually quite quite bad in this build so yes kind of useless so i don't think so you will definitely be used about if we i don't think so it will be ever use these things app cloner split screen everything is good here if you want to use these split screen options they have all the gestures available for you some gestures are quite good which i didn't saw in me why and as i previously mentioned in the terms of speed real me why is more optimized than me why in my preferences that's why i will definitely use real me if they remove blotware and if i get the indian version i think so i will use real miui compared to miui because miui is now actually quite laggy very very heavy software you can see these options the ram management is looking good i tried these things cleaner etc are uh, looking actually quite impressive and i didn't thought that i will use this real miui ever but yes i'm using it and i think so i'm using from past one or two days in my redmi note 5 pro and i definitely love this search downloads etc device and privacy camera pop-up effect some cool interesting features everything is present here unknown source installations authentication etc looks good enough secure app recommendation device id everything looks good enough some features also get the recent task manager for example if you want to enable this you will be able to see the ram etc in your recent tab if you move the recent tab like this you will see the ram and as you can see 1.3 gb free of 4 gb so that's actually quite impressive everything else i've already shown you i think so if you want to install this you can install the gsi gsi link i'll try to provide you in my website so you can visit on my website everything else is i've already shown you so these were the things thanks for watching and if you're new here don't forget to subscribe me as always I will definitely recommend you to subscribe me because a lot of users are watching the videos but they are not subscribing. We got very less watch time from the subscribers so yes I will recommend you to subscribe. Goodbye. Have a nice day. Over the edge like I'm floating through the air